welcome back. You're still watching Hype It Up right here on Cape Town TV mm -hmm. with myself, Mamila <laughs> Fuwe, and of course, Sassi That was our first two music videos. Please yeah. do stay tuned. We have so much more for you. That was number five and number four. But right now, mm -hmm. our following guest, he opened the show for us with yeah. a banger. It is, of course, MK Prince. How are you? Yeah. What's up? We need I'm more. Good, I'm good. I'm you, good. Did, you, did you hear the introduction? Yeah. So we need more. I'm going to do it again. We, we, we are chilling with MK Prince. Yo, what's yeah. up? What's up? What's up? <laughs> <laughs> How are you feeling? I'm good, thank you. I'm good, thank you. How are you doing? I'm good. Thank you so much for coming here. And of course, you might be busy, but you chose to be here with us. We thank you for that. Mm -hmm. Please tell people who is MK Prince and what is MK Prince all about. Damn. Okay, MK the Prince uh, is a hip hop artist, basically mm -hmm. an overall artist. Um, representing Cape Town, but Shut I'm up. more specific on the United States of Kylie. Cha. That's mm. what I all represent. Right. Mm. That's what I represent, yeah. So, so obviously representing Kylie Cha, and I know you've been in the game for a while, yeah, boy. Uh, looking at the game right now, yeah, boy. Looking at some of the things that are happening right now, and comparing back to where you started. Before I jump into that, yeah, boy. What inspired rapping? Um, well, basically, I'm not a person that is. I always tell people that I'm not a person that's very open and easy to speak. It's not very easy for me to speak. Okay. But it's very easy for me to voice out whatever I feel uh -huh. when I'm doing it through music. Yeah. Okay. So that's why I felt like that would be best for me. And then from there, I just started polishing the scale and going to workshops mm -hmm. and stuff like this because it's one thing to have talent, but if you're not nurturing it, it's. Ooh, yeah. You understand? Yeah. Yeah. So can I ask, what sets MK Prince from any other hip hop artist? Well, I do me. That's the one thing. Okay. The Nothing one. can ever pressure me. Like, mm -hmm. you can put whoever to perform in front of me. They're not going to bother me. So you keep it 100. Exactly. I'm just me. Right. Uh -huh. You can never take that from me. You yeah, can never oh, yeah. be me more than me. So yeah. it's impossible. So me being a big fan of especially hip hop, yeah, I up, yeah, but, um, I want to I wanna ask this question because I always, I always want to know, yeah, because I also, uh, I also wanna, always want to know that the contribution that we have with culture and hip hop right now is always one. Yeah, affective. Yeah, well, com comparing hip hop to being and back in the day when, when you started, what are the, some of the things that you think are new in Goku or some of the things that you think how much that reply or that just started rapping Goku can work on more? Um, okay, I thought I got that question, but you twisted it. <laughs> um, to answer what I first got from your question, what I feel like I, I wish I could have known way back uh -huh, then yeah. um, that I know now is that music is, is competitive, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. It's competitive, and at the very same time, the only way you can compete best is by being yourself. Like, mm. growing up, I used to try and be like so-and-so, ah. so-and-so, so-and-so, and that mm. wasted a lot of my time. Yeah. Um, I had to learn that the hard way when I went to Sweden, yeah. and I found that like, yo, a lot of people here sound like me, and I could have like mm. sounded more yeah. South African mm. and stood out, you understand? So. Yeah, it's, it's being myself. That's the one thing that yeah. I feel like I should have learned a long time ago. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now let's talk about your single that you performed on the show, Break the Bank. Mm -hmm. First of all, Break the Bank, you need to type this <laughs> you just t t what? Tell us the, the story behind your single or your song, Break the Bank. Um, well, Break the Bank is basically a song whereby, like, I come from a community whereby everyone wants to live their best life, but, you know, yeah. it's not always easy to do that. Yeah. We have so many things that we... we that are looking to us for us to be able to solve. Yeah. You'll be a working individual, but at home there's A, B, and C. By the time you're done with that, trying to get to D, there's nothing for mm. you to you understand. Mm, yeah. So um, so Break the Bank was the kind of thing whereby I was trying to like motivate people. Look, always try and find a way. Always try and find a way to live your best life, even if sometimes it will not require, it, don't, it won't always require the maximum amount of finance. Yeah, yeah. You just need to be able to plan properly. Uh -huh. For instance, Doing the music video for this song, for me, like financially, I was not in the best place. Mm -hmm. okay. But I managed to get the be one of the best music videos out from it. Mm. You understand? Yeah. So it's, it's, it's basically just to motivate people like, yo, we're not always going to be in the best positions, but that shouldn't stop us from being who we want to be. Yeah. Are we, are we. Give me uh, the next two years, what is Prince, uh, what is MK The Prince going to be doing? In the next two years, yeah. okay, right now I know that I'm working on an EP. Okay. okay. Man. Okay. Maybe it's I should. Maybe I should. Uh, nah, you, no, you are saying it's out there. The thing is, I've been hinting people, so when okay. people see this, they're gonna understand. Um, I'm dropping an EP titled 8:20 PM okay. very soon. 
Um, and the reason why I titled it 8.20 p.m. is basically some of the stuff that motivated me to write during okay. 2020 because 8.20 p.m. digital time is 2020. Yeah. Uh-huh. You understand? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So most of the stuff that I did on there was stuff that, I, uh, that motivated me to write such stuff. Okay. There are songs that I did on there with people that have never set foot in studio, but because I have my own studio, okay. I, I can afford that luxury of just pulling people in and be like, yo, mm-hmm, yeah. I see something in you. Let's work on something. Let's polish yeah. this here and there. I'm trying to do things that people never did for me. You understand? Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. Because we're always too quick to point at fingers at the youth. Ah, they're doing that and that, mm-hmm. but we're not yeah. assisting mm-hmm. them to get yeah. them in the, yeah. in the right direction. So that's what I'm working on. Um, should be pushing it next year. Should be shooting music videos because I'm trying to shoot a music video for each and every one of those. Okay. I already have three music videos in the bag for that EP. I'm trying to shoot something that's going to be like a concert, but more like a DVD for it. So that's my next two-year plan for that. Well, you heard it, guys. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you so much for performing right here on Hype It Up. So much more you can expect right here on the show. MK Prince was not the only one. We have so much more right here. We'll be right back. Bang. Bang.